PRC comments any comments I'm looking for posts with a comment there's one comment here okay so there's a comment here PM me for more information okay this care hey my friend Jean-Serge Gagnon here and today we're going to talk about why should you wait before you start sending all those pms and all those friend requests and why do leaders tell you to do that and we're talk about why it's why it would be better if you waited i'm going to explain exactly why in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets. And that's right, leaders will tell you, go ahead and send little 5, 10, 20 friend requests a day, send a PM, make sure you go to their profile, check out their page and put in a, send them a message that's kind of like, you know, connects with them and that kind of stuff. And all that's very good. It's all very good. But there's issues with doing that when you're starting out and we're going to talk about exactly what those issues are and why waiting is good from a perspective of building your online presence building your online brand your personal brand doing attraction marketing we're going to talk exactly about all that stuff in just a minute before we do that I want to remind you if you're listening to the audio of this you're going to want to go check out the video at cis496.jsgagnon.com because I will be sharing my screen and it'll be a lot more visual you can see my expressions and all that good stuff right all right so <clears throat> let's get to it let me share my screen and show you what I'm talking about <clears throat> okay sorry so you know most leaders they'll tell you go to Facebook and you know um comment on stuff engage on things and you know I'm not say, don't, not saying not to do that you definitely need to do that but the one thing that they'll tell you that you need to do which which is also very true is that you need to have conversations with people because that's the only way you'll get sales at least in the beginning until you have like this massive following and you've got all these social proof and all sorts of other people saying how great your stuff is and you know you won't get purchases sign-ups or new team members or anything like that in the beginning because nobody knows who you are you know the only people that know who you are is your family and they're probably tired of you bugging them about your stuff right so you need to go out there and find strangers right that's that's what you got to do and you know what you do is you you can go you go to groups and you know there's a lots of different things let, let you know what let's talk about let's just put that here let's just talk about what do leaders whoops what do leaders tell you to to do now right so number one they'll tell you to you know uh, set up your profile they'll tell you to um, post regularly right um, know your know your audience and your offer right I mean you got to know these things and you got to be posting regularly you got to be setting up your profile number four they'll tell you uh, engage on other people's posts right they'll tell you to do those things now those things you should be doing by the way definitely it's super important if you don't have a, a profile set up properly nobody's gonna be able to really tell who what you're about where you're from it's not really about where you're from but you know are you somebody who can help them right uh, do you have things that they uh they, they they're looking for do, are you so they kind of have to know kind of what you're about what your values are maybe and that kind of stuff and also if you don't post regularly Facebook will just stop showing you to other people right I mean you can't post something and then a year later expect you know Facebook to send to share your posts I mean that's that can happen on TikTok it can happen on YouTube um but not really on Facebook on Facebook if you don't post regularly which is at least a few times a week um 
you're going to stop being relevant right so you got to do that the other thing is you have to know who your audience is or your avatar your offer I, I talk at length about those things in other in other episodes but basically you need to know what to talk or how to talk how to create what kind of messages to create right um you need to know what is the pain points of your perfect customer right you need to know those things otherwise your content won't speak to them when they see it right so it's got to be relevant to them otherwise they're not going to be interested in following you or checking out your rest of your content or even commenting on your stuff right then number four you have to engage on other people's posts because that's one of the things that Facebook requires of you to do you it's a reciprocal algorithm that means that if you don't do that nobody's going to see your stuff because you're not engaging Facebook isn't going to share your stuff because you're not somebody who's engaging on the on the platform right just share just posting stuff isn't going to be an, isn't enough so the leaders now the next thing the leaders tell you to do is you must talk to people to make sales that's basically what they say right you've got to talk to people to make sales now if you don't talk to anybody you're not going to make any sales in the beginning that's 100 percent true and the reason is just because people don't buy from random strangers that they don't know right so you got to get that conversation and you got to talk to people now what happens is inevitably we're like okay well uh okay I'll just talk to people so the leaders they'll tell you you know send I don't know five to ten friend requests with a p.m per day all right so they say send five to ten friend requests so what, what does that mean right you're going through the news feed right you're going through the news feed and you see or maybe you go to uh, pages or groups let's say we go to a group right I go to a group and uh, let's find uh, successful no these are let's say this one high ticket affiliate marketing worldwide right let's say I'm looking for people to sell something I have or whatever or I'm just trying to find so I'm going to come in here I'm going to look at this look Gracie Hall I'm going to go to her profile and then I'm going to look at her posts and I'm going to say you know bring business to you virtually I'm going to send her a message I'm going to come in here I'm going to say hey you know Grace that's I'm behind my face there let me move that out of the way I'm going to be like this right I'm going to say hey Grace uh saw you were a business online person blah 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 right I, you help coaches I saw that you help coaches and I just thought it would be cool to connect now this example is probably uh, you know because she's an online she actually builds online uh helps coaches and consultants I could probably say I'm a consultant or I'm a coach and I'm I always like to connect with other coaches chances are she'll reply right but if you're trying to like sell weight loss right and you go into a group let's say weight loss if I just go to weight loss and I just go to groups right here right and I look into I'm not in any of these groups I don't think because that's kind of not my business but I might be able to see a public group so weight loss tips so this is a public group which means I can see the posts and I can actually come here and look at this justice tendra here or more likely what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to go here see comments any comments I'm looking for posts with a comment there's one comment here okay so there's a comment here pm me for more information okay this Karen here she said you know send me information right so she might be oh it's actually her her own it's her own post <laughs> here she's uh, so that's kind of weird Oh, PM me for oh, she's just telling people to PM her for more information she would actually be answering PMs but the point is yeah that's the thing let's say what's the other way let's say I go and I look for Diane Hockman Diane Hockman is one of my favorite online people she's been in the business for a long long time but and the thing that some leaders tell you to do is go see right go to her followers go to her followers and then look at these uh, all these people that are following her right so go to one of her 
people are following her and then look at what that person posted and then send them a message right message add friend whatever right so anyways the point is that if you go through this process that leaders are telling you to do right and you do that if you you know comment and and send a message send a message to somebody and then and then uh send them a friend request right click on the ad friend here and send them a message saying hey blah 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 I saw your post about this I thought we should connect and you know whatever wording you want to use the problem is that <coughs> lots of people if not 90 percent of them will ignore you right so what happens is so if you do this you will get 80 to 90 percent of people ignore ignoring you right they're gonna ignore you now you might be like oh well you know what that's fine leaders told me this that most people wouldn't ignore me that's fine it's just a numbers game so I'm just gonna keep going and I'm gonna send messages and send messages and send messages it doesn't matter if I send 10 messages I get one reply or two replies you know I just have to send 100 messages to get 20 replies right and that's a numbers game that you know it's kind of true but you're forgetting a major 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 issue with doing that first you are sending I don't know eight messages that don't get replied to just keep in mind Facebook is recording all that Facebook is recording that you sent 80 messages that got no response that put that people said I don't know this person right you know how you get a message and you choose whether you know the person or not by clicking yes or no Facebook actually asks you that uh, like I'm not saying that all of them are going to say they don't know you but you know some of them will so what happens there is that your Facebook account gets less and less valuable to Facebook Facebook doesn't like that kind of behavior so they'll 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 they'll, they'll I put black marks against your account that you won't even know about that's one thing I mean I'm, I'm speculating here because I kind of understand how program works and how the algorithm kind of works but there's no proof in what I'm saying this is just supposition but it's very likely that something like that happens because uh, because Facebook just does that right so now the thing is you've got to keep in mind if you do this every single day well there's that so number one you might get some sort of black mark against your account because there's lots of people that aren't even replying to your message that are just ignoring you right number two you'll get you know stressed out from sending messages to people that never reply to you you'll feel like this isn't working that great and you're not going to feel good about yourself and you'll actually get people replying saying nasty things to you right some of them are actually going to be verbal about how annoying it is to get all these messages right so that's the other thing and so you don't you don't want that right but but leaders and you know uh, the ones that are really like push 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 go 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 just it's just a numbers game they're going to be like you know just do it cuz you know it's worth sending 100 messages to get one or two sales because you wouldn't get the sales if you didn't send any messages right so the thing with that is that you if you, even if you kept going and you kept doing exactly that activity right even if you sent these let me go back to the webcam here even if you sent you know 10 messages every single day right you send 10 messages a day you get one or two replies so the next day you're at four the next day you're at you know six eight after a month after a month of sending 10 messages a day you would have sent 300 messages and you would have gotten probably you know um 60 replies and had conversations and might have gotten a few sales maybe you got five sales I don't know right maybe you got five sales and the thing is that that is cons constant constant every single month you're gonna have to do that right so what if so what if what if you waited what would be the benefit of waiting whoops I got my screen there sharing I forgot it so you know what if you waited right what if you waited let me put that fella back down to the bottom here 
I mean, what if you waited? What would be the difference, right? If you okay, so if you well, so let's first do this. If you do, um, if you do, uh, let's say ten messages a day and get two replies after a month whoops after 30 days you'd have sent 300 messages and gotten uh, 60 replies right perhaps five sales I don't know maybe right I'm not saying that that's accurate because obviously it depends on a whole sort whole lot of factors but the end result is and this is what leaders tell you the end result is if you um if you do this every day and you keep doing it every day it's just gonna you know you're just gonna get your numbers are gonna get better you might get more uh more sales out of the 60 replies maybe you'll get more replies because your messages are getting better or maybe people are starting to notice your content but the thing the truth of it is that you will not have the the best results you possibly could than if you waited and I'm going to explain to you why okay because okay so what if you waited so first <coughs> what if you waited so the first thing that happens is if you wait there's a couple things that happen right what happens what if you waited okay number one you'll have mastered the content creation right you'll have mastered that because you have been creating content for you know, let, let's say we wait three months or we wait six months just for fun let's say six months okay actually you know before we do that so perhaps five sales per month or 50 60 60 sales per year okay you have 60 sales per year that just as a going back to that right so that's kind of what let's say you did five sales per month that would be 60 sales per year if you did this every single month sending a hundred you know 10 messages a day that is insane by the way because well you send 10 messages a day you get two replies that means you're having two converse potentially two conversations per day but normally they last more than a day right you might run into the next day or or sometimes people don't reply until a week later or whatever that's happens but just you know average right so if you wait this is the thing if you wait you'll have mastered the content creation number two you'll have engaged with hundreds hundreds of people's content okay you'll have engaged I mean be, because you're doing these things well, you're doing these things you set up your profile you're posting regularly you know your audience is offer you're engaging on other people's posts you're doing that you're still doing that you're just waiting for these right you're doing these things you're still doing these things you know regularly and that's a lot right learning the platform learning how to create posts learning canva learning the tools learning all sorts of things learning about understanding your audience better learning about creating content right you're doing all that imagine if you did that for six months and I'm not saying six months you could do it for three you could do it for a year if you wanted but the end result is that the longer you wait the more powerful you're going to become and number three you'll have tons I would say could say hundreds I could say thousands I could say well let's say hundreds of people who know who you are so how different let's fix that how different do you think conversations go with people that know who you are right no and probably and alike right they probably like you too because they've seen your content they've seen you engage on their posts they've seen you commenting on their stuff they've seen you replying to the comments on your posts they've seen your posts they've went to your profile everything all that has happened so what do you think will happen when you do that so if you waited 
right if you waited and just built the foundation right just build the foundation right just build the foundation if you just build the foundation and then you go and start having conversations right I'm not I mean okay this is what's going to happen right instead of this if you build a foundation and you send I I sending five to ten requests a day would be ridiculous it would be insane because you won't have the time to deal with all of them because 90 percent of them will get back to you because they'll be like oh that's whoever contacting me oh yeah I really like them they they've engaged on my stuff they've done things they they've helped me with my reach on my post they've done this they've done that they've they've liked my post they know about my you know my my dog's uh, um, um, veterinary visit last two months ago you know they they know me I like them so I'm gonna reply to them and say hey how's it going yes 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 okay so if you wait and you build your foundation this is what's gonna happen you're gonna get well let's just say we send let's because like I said it's gonna be ridiculous if you say if you send five to ten friend requests with Pima every day you will get 80 to 90 percent of people replying to you right they're not going to ignore you that there's going to be some that will ignore you but they're going to all reply to you so you can have a conversation with them so that means what does that mean right so let's just take this so down here copy it down here so if you do 10 messages a day and get 18 replies after 30 days let's do the math here I got a calculator where's my calculator there's a calculator let's bring it over to the other side let's put that right here got that here can I make it smaller than that because I don't need it that big right yeah well, that's the smallest I can do okay let's put it up here okay so if I do 10 if I get 18 messages so that means I get 18 times 30 that's 540 messages after 30 days is that right well you can't have 10 messages and 18 replies let's say you get eight replies <laughs> right after 30 days you'd have sent all right still 300 messages but you've gotten eight times 30. you've gotten 240 replies 240 replies so out of 240 replies these are people that know like you right they already know who you are they're like they feel connected to you already how many of those do you think you'll get as sales are you going to get you know five sales like we had before we had five sales out of 60 we said five out of 60. do you think we'll have just that what is that percentage so that's uh how do I is it 60 divided by no five divided by 60 that's eight percent so that's eight percent so perhaps eight percent sales okay let's just say eight percent maybe it's less than that but anyways whatever that was just actually it'd probably be less than that because that's a high number for uh people that don't know who you are right but still that was just to be you know positive and say that you'll get that so but let's say you get eight percent of 240 right so if I do 240 times uh eight percent is 19.2 so that would be 19 so 19.2 at eight percent or would it be fair to think that you're going to get like 30 or maybe even 50 percent sales from these people probably right because they like I said they know you they like you they already believe in you they already you know know that you're not out there to scam them they 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 you've built a foundation for months right maybe six months maybe even a year but they know who you are and they're willing to you know buy something from you if if you have something to sell them so let's say or at let's say 30 percent that's 30 percent or yeah let's do that so so 240 240 times 30 percent is 72 
so that's 72 sales 72 sales so 72 sales versus five sales now this is per month <laughs> this is per month so over here we had 60 sales per year but then over here we have we have 72 times 12 70 like <laughs> like okay here's the thing let's go back to the math here 72 times 12 that's 864 864 sales per year so this is where the difference comes in and because there's lots of factors that cause people to buy from you right one is they if they know you and they trust you and they like you they're much more likely to buy from you and it's it's not just about buying from you. it's also just having a conversation with you they're not they're not gonna waste their energy talking to somebody who they don't even know who they who that is they don't even know who you are what you're about they're not gonna have that conversation but if you know if they know because they followed you because like see Carol Car Carlota here if I send her a message she's gonna be like who is this guy she's not gonna have any clue who I am because she's trying to sell stuff online she might actually have a conversation you might you're, you'd be more likely to have conversation with people that do that but if I really want to work on weight loss if I want to work on weight loss or this is actually I was looking at Diane Hockman's uh, followers right so if I go through Diane Hockman's followers here one of the things that people say is just go in here and just follow 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 you know follow all these people right uh the ones that you can follow it used to be that you could act there was actually a button right here to follow people now I guess they change it so that you have to do this extra step to uh because they don't want people to click 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 right but that's the thing right I mean if you follow this thing the steps that the leaders tell you which is go ahead you got to connect with people it's you don't have to you don't have to do that in the beginning like again if I go back to weight loss <clears throat> and I just look at groups groups and I look at groups that have like you know 83,000 people right this is a public group so let's just go here and there's somebody who posts something here and there's a bunch of people that comment right so I got 24 comments right here so I might try to connect with all these people here right because they're into weight loss maybe they're interested I might be I might just look at their profile and see whether they're you know potentially somebody who I might be interested in right but the problem with that is that they have no clue who I am if I wait and they if I wait and I do the stuff I was telling you right right you still do those those things you pro, post set up your profile post regularly know your audience know your offer and post regularly and comment on stuff if you do that stuff and you come back here six months later and you see these names here they probably won't have a clue who you are anyways so there's a where a, and that's why leaders say well don't worry about it just go ahead and do those things it doesn't really matter you can't really do better but I beg to differ I beg to differ there's a way that you can actually do this better I can actually come I have a well you know the thing is I built a tool right I built a tool to allow me to get this David here and this Patrick here to kind of know who I am how do you do that how do you do that without them feeling that you're bugging them or spamming them well you know one way would be to go to their profile go see what posts they have and just comment on their stuff why do people post on Facebook they want people to comment on their stuff they want people to see them they want people to reply to their stuff they want their stuff to be seen by others right so by you engaging on their posts you're kind of helping them so they're automatically gonna like you because you're doing things now obviously if they think you're out to get something from them by doing that whatever that's their problem um, but no just don't be doing it just for that reason right do it because you're trying to build your brand because you're trying to show others that you're there to help them so do that but doing this through the group <coughs> sorry <coughs> is a lot of work it's pretty insane so that's why I created active group users right so active group users is a chrome extension that you install in chrome <coughs> and then you give it a list of groups that you want it to go to so what the extension will do is it'll go to these groups 
like say say I put this group in here right it would go to this group and it'll go and find the posts like it'll say it'll find today here it'll find the comments that are here it'll find uh <coughs> who posted and who commented okay so then you get a list of people that have if I go to active group users here let's just put the link in there for you so you can get a free trial activegroupusers.com <coughs> just go there and get yourself a free trial I'm actually going to be putting together uh software demos and things like that but for now you can go and get your trial and um and then after you've done that if you go to it once you've installed it once it's gone to the groups it's gotten figured out what uh people who is in the groups who is commenting who is posting and it gives you a list of people then what you do is you use that list to go to their profiles so you know you could do it by just clicking on names here I could just click on on this name here right to Tammy here and go visit her profile I click on her name then I go to her view profile right here to go to her main profile then I look at the post that she's got comment on the stuff <coughs> and she's going to see my name and my face notifications hopefully she's going to appreciate that and then if she sees me enough you know not just once that's not enough right they have to see you multiple times on their profiles on their posts <clears throat> then she's going to start to notice who I am and probably go to my profile go check out what I'm about and also what's going to happen is Facebook and Facebook will start to show my posts in her feed and her posts in my feed as well so right that's kind of how it all happens but the thing is that that takes a lot of time and how do you know that Tammy how do you know how many times you visited her profile right how many posts you've gone and when's the last time you did it whatever that's what the tool gives you it gives you a list of all the people and also tells you when you visited them right here it says oh not yet because I just haven't visited these I'm just wondering what am I looking at here well the sort order the list and everything else is all based on on that if I just click on say uh visited right here it'll show me who I visited today uh whoever is it a day ago two days ago three days ago that kind of stuff so it lets me kind of track the activity on my Facebook page see how I visited all these people nine hours ago six hours ago yesterday right and I can load more here I got 287 names from this scrape so what it does it does a scrape every day gives you a list every day and then you choose to engage on the post that you want by going through the list of names that you have here right I can load more here and it'll show me more of the people that are on this list right and that's kind of how you use the tool but the thing is that that lets you truly truly build your foundation you can build your foundation and still do all this content creation and the engagement on posts but take control the other thing too is that you can do is you just spend half an hour a day on Facebook you don't have to spend hours on Facebook every day with a tool like this you just pick the 10 20 people I do 20 people a day as you can see right here this shows me 20 20 yesterday the day before 25 one another day 21 on average so that lets me engage on these people's posts and it takes the guesswork out of who I should be engaged on and I don't spend my time in the news feed I just go there and you can do that too and after a while you'll have a ton of people who know who you are who you can have conversation with and you can make those sales because they'll know like and trust you and that's all you want that's the secret you want that then you won't have to send you know 10 messages a day you can send only one a day and that's enough to build so many sales can you, how could you possibly handle this many sales right that's why that's why leaders tell you to just do that because really you can't handle more right but I would rather send just a few messages a day instead of 10 I would like to send one or two and not have to worry about you know people ignoring me because they know who I am and that's what you can do too you can do that too right all you got to do is go to active group users get yourself an account get that set up build your foundation and then after enough time you'll be able to send messages with everybody replying to you all right hopefully uh you thought that was valuable and we'll see you in the next episode don't forget 
you can actually not, not forget just just go ahead and ask me questions if you have any comments or questions about this and we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Ooh. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.